Morning everyone. This is a good time to start filming. Ah, bless him. Anyway, look, welcome to Horsey. I was, um, for my, one of my last vlogs, I was at Horsey Beach and Horsey Dunes photographing. Today I'm inland photographing this old girl behind me, Horsey Mill. She's just been renovated or, you know, fairly recently renovated. So it's been a long time since any of us Norfolk photographers have been able to photograph the old girl. But she's looking lovely. She's facing the wrong way. She obviously didn't know I was coming, but she always faces that way. There's a little stave the other side of her, which makes a nice shot, but the boats are a bit ugly at the moment. So um, I won't be doing that one today. Placed myself in the wrong position or the wrong location to tell you the truth. The sky out to sea, beautiful. Bit heavy there beside us um, or behind the mill there. And I'm not sure looking over at the sky there whether there's gonna get any light on the mill because it's quite a nice shot down this wee dike here. But anyway, I'm out, got myself out early on a um, Saturday morning in the summer. So that's a, that's a miracle in itself. So let's go and see what else is about. Some big old heavy cloud coming in though, but anyway, good to be out. I'll catch up in a little while. That's a frustrating morning. Lovely sky out to sea. Quite a nice sky over that way. The way I want to shoot, heavy, heavy sky. No light coming through. This huge bank of cloud you see is just moving across. It's blocking out the sun. So the sun's not gonna come through, which is a pity because I quite like this here today. It's a lot, like I say, long time since I've shot here, but all the greens are looking nice. There's, a, there's enough variation in the greens for it to look, look okay, rather than being a, a green fest, technical term. The grasses out there on the, um, on the field in front of the mill look rather nice. A bit of yellow there, so that would have been another layer. They've got the mast of the boats in the background. Ah, oh, it's a pity. There you go, gotta be in it to win it. So I'm gonna move on, see if I can see any, anywhere else to photograph this morning. Might go for a bit of a walk. But for the moment, Horsey Mill, we have unfinished business. See you in a little while. Well, here I am, guys, in Backton Woods. I've had a good old drive up the coast. I uh, didn't want to do any coastal stuff today, really. Done too much of that recently. So I've come for a walk in the woods. The cloud, cloud cover's pretty heavy now, so the light's going to be pretty, pretty good for wood and stuff. And I'm, I've sort of set myself a little challenge here to get to really get to know me um, 135 and use me 135 and try stuff and see how it all goes. So I'm just going to go out for a little walk. There's no one about at the moment, nice and quiet, so I can get on with my photography undisturbed. And um, it's woodland photography time. Not my natural habitat, but hey, let's have a go and see what we can see what we can do. This is a rather nice scene. I rather like the, um, there's quite a variation of colors, but actually perhaps more than I thought there would be um, at this time of year, but give it a little bit of a warm white balance, maybe a little bit of toning, and this might be quite an effective image. I'll put up a few variations from here in a sec, and probably some more from the air as I go exploring. I don't want to keep stopping every, every two or three minutes talking because there's, um, there's quite a few people around now. Oh guys, it's been a little, um, been a bit of a little eye opener for me this morning. I really have enjoyed shooting in the woods and I haven't finished today yet. It's just, just absolutely lovely. I should come in here more often and try. It's great practice for me. It's not something I do naturally. You know, if you wanna, have a look at some work of some great woodland photographers. Look at people like Mark Littlejohn, Darren Cholly Leach. Wonderful stuff. Go and have a look at that. I'm just merely a learner, but it's good to try. 
been very difficult to get to, to get going with it um, this morning because there's so many people about. I thought it'd be pretty quiet. Saturday morning, a lot of people out walking their dogs, all want to chit chat, all fascinated by what I'm doing. But it's been lovely. And I think I've got some nice stuff for me, you know, to other people's woodland standard, well, you know, but for me, they're pretty good. So I'm going to carry on, see what else I can see. And yeah, get back to you in a little while. light is so nicely muted now that even shooting towards a quite bright sky still brings you know rather nice results so I'm just gonna have a go around here beautiful lime greens coming through really really nice <laughs> Gibbo in woodland and enjoying himself Well, I think that'll do for today. Thanks ever so much for joining me in the Norfolk Broads first and now in lovely Backton Woods. This has been a real bonus coming here and um, I was in a sort of, a, oh, do I go home? But I'm glad I made the, made the effort to go for a drive, have a little look around and to come in here today has been an absolute blast. Really, really enjoyed it. Um, made some mental notes up here for autumn, foggy conditions. I've never walked in this part of Backton Woods before and it is just brilliant. So it's been a really good morning with a little surprise. Thanks for watching guys. Please do consider subscribing if you haven't already and I hope to see you soon wherever that may be from. Take care, look after yourselves. Bye for now.